Hello, today is unfortunately not a uh, foliage Friday because I did not have a chance to update yesterday, so foliage Saturday, I guess. <laughs> but it is Saturday, uh, July 17th, 2021, and uh, it is about 82 degrees uh, right now here in Melbourne, Florida. Pretty clear sky, lightly cloudy. Um, it is for my opinion too hot but a lot of people this is like their paradise weather but, but anyways uh let me update you on my plants so today is day 167 for my red pepper plant uh, falcon and she's the same height <clears throat> as the last time but I mean, she does have a lot of new flowers coming in uh there's one um, here's another one. Here, let me see if I can focus. Yeah, okay. Let's see. There's another one here. So, preferably, these flowers will fall off and peppers will grow in. So, uh, there's a lot of, like, new leaf growth. Like, you don't see these little leaves. But the thing is, it's like, there's new, new flowers budding and everything. It's just, I feel like they're just so overpopulated they keep growing in the same little area I wish I could like space them out somehow maybe I can if you know how I can and I don't know about it you let me know <laughs> no new growth here on the bottom um, but yeah a lot of growth on top um, she was watered about a gallon of water uh, throughout the week and I gave her some some coffee grounds um, and I gave her like a real little bit of water this morning um, you know, red pepper or pepper plants need a lot of water, so I feel like what I gave her was like a sip of water or something. But anyways, uh, so far, so good with her. Um, yeah, so I don't know, I haven't paid attention of how long it takes the peppers to grow in, but probably by summer's end, they might start growing in, I guess, maybe. Anyways, but, um... So that's how she's doing. She's doing good. And then my kale plant uh, that I've named Bonnie. She's um, always doing really well. She's uh, 120 days years old. You see these two um, leaves here that are drooping. Those will be the ones I harvest this weekend. But uh, otherwise she's growing really good. She's also the same height. About, uh, about a foot tall, 12 inches, and uh, as I show you every week, which I know can't be too exciting, <laughs> she's got new new babies growing in here, so she's doing pretty good, the bright green, I guess I haven't been allowing the bottom ones to drop a lot to, for them to turn blue, um, so, but I mean, I don't mind. <laughs> And then, last but not least, is my succulent plant that I've named Ava. Uh, she is 85 uh, days old. Um, I'm going to water her on Monday because I'm going to be watering her every month on the 19th. That's when I watered her last. Um, so, so, yeah, Monday she'll get more. Um, I don't think that my camera will let me focus enough, but you, she does have really tiny microscopic little leaves coming in here. Um, I know I've probably been saying it the last couple of videos, I'm going to put more soil to cover this up. I just, uh, have been had a hectic schedule last, um, few weeks. But anyways, uh, sooner than later, hopefully, um, I'll be able to put more soil in there and then water her, um... And then also later I'm going to put more like coffee and eggshells in all of them, all the plants as well. And then I'm going to a garden expo this weekend. So I'm going to see just what they have there. I might come home with a new plant baby. We'll see. Depends on a lot of things. Um, but okay, thank you so much for watching and make it a great day.